Here's a quick look at how I get from here to here. In the Blender compositor, first I add a hint of mist. I talk more about that in my mist and fog video. Then I add a bit of lens distortion. Just the hint helps rough up the clean plastic CG look a bit, particularly in the corners of the screen. Next I add some glare. I've already added bloom to the bright areas, but I wanted to fog the lens a little bit further. Now let's treat her out on Blender for a moment and move over to After Effects. First thing I do here is add some lens flare to make the image a little more cinematic. Next I add a hint of vignette. A hint is all you need to guide your eye to the action. Anything more than a hint can look awful. You kind of need to not notice it's there. Next I add a bit of manual colour correction. Dark areas need brightening bright areas need darkening and all the colors need to bring in closer together. Then I added a LUT which are essentially downloadable color correction presets and yeah it's kind of weird to add color correction on top of color correction but it's a quick way of adding a more film-like look to your work. And then I sharpen the image a bit. It just helps bring out a bit more detail and to make the edges more defined. I like the look anyway. And that's about it. Before. After. Before. After. Before. After.